The statistics on Alzheimer's are head spinning. 5.4 million Americans are living with it. One in eight older Americans has it. It's the sixth leading cause of death in this country. Alzheimer's can't be prevented or cured, but doctors stress the importance of catching it early. Early diagnosis certainly has benefits. While you still have most of your or all of your functional ability to make decisions and, and exercise good judgment. Several new studies converged on a common point. The way you walk may provide an early indicator of cognitive impairment. Movement is one of the things they look for during a comprehensive screening given by Lee Memorial Health System. We're fortunate to have neuropsychologists that spend about three hours interviewing people, doing standardized tests where they are able to compare the person against their age-related norms. Researchers found thinking skills like memory and information processing decline almost in parallel to the ability to walk fluidly. So they're honing in on things like a slow pace, a change in gait, and loss of control. We do physical examination, so we look at how the brain controls your balance, how well you can move your body rapidly, alternating from one position to another. So when it comes to evaluating and predicting Alzheimer's, there may be something in the way we move. We look at all those things and try and put together a full picture. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.